Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is a uh, demonstration of Google Spreadsheet Programming. Uh, the author is um, very thoughtful and, and posts fairly regularly. He's written a book, um, Mick at JavaScript Programming. <clears throat> He's uh, got a piece of code here that I've went ahead and run, <coughs> copied and run, and <coughs> effectively what it does is it allows you to do a number of things, but the most important for me was the named ranges. So what I've done here, I'll, I'll show you the script here, we've got <coughs> three functions, add name, examine name, and clear all. Uh, in order for any of this to work, you have to run add names first, so I'm going to run that and that's run and I've created these ranges already um, so let's go ahead and delete a few actually let's delete them all clear all named ranges I run the script when I go back to the page they should all be gone and they are so now uh, let's go ahead and uh, create a named range click add range and in this case I'm going to select all of these teams give it a name I'll we'll call it teams click done and that's all well and good so let's how we can use this going forward well number one is we can use it for data validation which is what I kind of suggest we do here uh, so I'm going to create a data validation and the cell range in this case is sheet 4 a1 and now I'm going to list from a range and I click on when I click here I can click on this and it automatically pulls that up uh, yeah okay there it goes so I have to select select the teams from the range over here on the right hand side which in this case is sheet 1 B3 B3 to 22 click OK and save and now when I go to my sheet 4 you see I have a new data validation point and I click on it you can see all of the uh, teams here I start typing the first letter and it brings it up for me so that's um, that's that's handy um, there's a lot of other things here in this script that are worth investigating uh, namely the import HTML function which I've not uh, explored yet but in terms of data validation this uh, this could be very useful uh, for individuals who for example want to create a new range let's try uh, let's just pick a few from this we're going to add a range and I'm going to pick just a few of these randomly and now uh, tack, let's give this a name test and now uh, I need to click in here sheet B1 and now let's try it again select a range ah okay so it doesn't allow for random selection it'll select these the uh, all of them in a row but it won't necessarily see that I've selected B9 and then B11 it it doesn't have it's not that smart but it does collect them all in a row all right that's not the end of the world but it's good to know thanks for watching and give uh, give this site a, a gander javascript spreadsheet programming .com. Uh, this guy's published a book and he publishes uh, occasionally on blog as well. Thank you for your time and 
heavy computing. 